happened in our village, which I think was a shock to many of us. A shock, first of all, that Peaches Gelbhoff actually lived in our community. And then the terrible news that she was found dead, aged 25 with two young children. And so today, as she was part of our community, we're going to say some prayers now. Let us pray. God of mercy, Lord of life, you have made us in your image to reflect your truth and light. We give you thanks for peaches, for the grace and mercy she received from you, and for all that was good in her life. God of hope, we come to you in shock of what has happened this week in our community. Help us to find peace in the knowledge of your loving mercy to all your children, and give us light to guide us out of our darkness into the assurance of your love in Jesus Christ our Lord. Lord our God, you bless the family and friends through the gift of peaches, who is now taken away from them and whose loss they mourn. Comfort, we pray, her husband and young children, Sir Bob and all the family. Help them through their tears and pain to glimpse your hand at work, to bring blessing out of grief. Lord Jesus Christ, you comforted your disciples when you were going to die. Now set troubled hearts at rest and banish fears. You are the way to the Father. Help us to follow you. You are the truth. Bring us to know you. You are the life. Give us that life to live with you now and forever. 